Our paper computes sliced optimal transport of point clouds of different cardinalities that relies on a new fast partial linear assignment algorithm in one dimension. Starting with the nearest neighbor assignment computed in linear time, we solve a sub-problem of increasing size. Here, in the first sub-problem involving one single point, the optimal solution is to match it to its nearest neighbor. Similarly, considering now the first two points, their nearest neighbors are different so they also yield an optimal transport solution. And similarly for the third, fourth and fifth points. Now, the nearest neighbor of the sixth point has already been assigned. We consider the options, that of assigning the sixth point to the next available location, or that of moving the entire sub-problem to the left by one to free one location on the right. We take the solution of lower cost, here, to move the sequence to the left. Then, the nearest neighbor of the seventh point is free and can be assigned. The nearest neighbor of the eighth point is occupied, and once again, we can either move the existing sequence to the left, thus merging the two intervals, or directly assign it to the right, which is the best option here. Again for the ninth point, considering both options, we assign it to the right. The tenth point can finally be assigned to its nearest neighbor. This decomposes the solution into three contiguous intervals. We also provide a quasi-linear time problem decomposition technique based on the same principles as well as other simplifications making our technique very fast. We now apply our technique to the problem of point set registration using a similarity transform, by extending the traditional ICP approach. Our method can also be used to partially transfer colors between images. We performed preliminary experiments on sliced partial barycenters of two point clouds of 100,000 points, varying the number of points in the barycenter. On the top, we initialized the optimization process with samples from the cat, while in the bottom we used a random initialization. As we can see, reducing the number of points in the barycenter exhibits the lack of convexity of the energy involved, since both results become different. Here, we show a failure case due to transport being optimal per slice and not in two dimensions. Full-fledged optimal transport solves this issue, but is intractable.